Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out... I, I don't even know what to call this anymore. Sadie R. Raw's naming scheme is just, like, completely out of control at this point, but, uh, yeah. Something about a passcode. Everything seems to work fine. First harder map since a longer time. Alright. Well, let's, let's check it out. Let's, let us... let us check it out. It's certainly a much bigger chamber than any of your previous maps, to my knowledge. Wow, this is a big area. Holy crap. Uh, okay then. Got gel there, I guess we're gonna bounce out of that onto the gel to get up there. Through that hole. That'd be my guess. What is even going on here? What does this do? Uh... Okay. Is that permanent? Is it a toggle? Well, I'm not actually sure what the point of that button was, but, uh, sure. Sure. That's a- that's a thing that has happened. It's a thing that's in this map. Who knows? <laughs> oh, we got turrets. That's, uh, alarming. Hmm. There's a hole to drop down to there again, if we want to. that, so maybe we'll funnel ourselves back up here at some point? Or maybe we'll put bounce gel? No, that wouldn't work. We wouldn't need bounce gel. What does that do? Oh, hey! That's exactly what I wanted, actually. Alright, so. Across from here is that. There we go. Give me this. So we got a laser cube now. I guess we can do stuff and things with that. What does the slant line go to again? Uh, flip panel. Okay. I guess this is our diving board into that. Yeah, seems like it. Hmm. Well, I think the next move will be to put the cube on the button, jump into that, on the bounce shell. Because that's... I can't really see what else to do, so yeah, let's try that. First, we gotta go through here again. There we go. I suppose we technically could've walked through the portal, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Makes little to no difference. So what's up with these guys? There's glass in front of those portal surfaces? Why, though? Hmm. Ha! <laughs> wow, they- what is the deal with these? Can they, like, partially see me, but not really? So what is through here, anyway? Okay, then. I guess this is just a return path in case we do that. With the turrets. That's gonna be my guess. Can't really see much of anything from here. Okay. Let's just get back up there, then. Go through here. Portal there. Portal there. Right. Actually, I didn't even need to do that, because I've already got the cube on the button, so... Portal there, portal here... Let's see what this does for us. Oh. Why didn't I just do this first? <laughs> well then, what is the point of these guys, if I can just get up here so easily to them? I... do not know. Right, well, let's start knocking them out. Goodbye. And how about you are next? Goodbye. And how about you just give me give me a turret? Ha <laughs> ha! Had to get one last shot in. Interesting. Uh 
okay? What activates that? We need a cube to activate that. Can't we just... do that? To some degree? Come here, laser cube. And then, can't we just... do this? And then, can't we just call him back? I think we can. I don't know if shooting through the hole there is kind of a cheaty thing to do. I genuinely don't know, but I mean... We could've just shot a portal... there. Gone through a portal here to adjust it come back out, and then shut the portal. So yeah, it's not a cheaty thing to do, because we could just easily do it anyway. Right, uh, not sure what the whole point of that was, but sure, let's get this... Let's get these cubes. Come on, now. Oh, come on. Don't you be that way with me. Alright, we got the cubes. Cubes acquired. Put one of them up here, and the other one up here. I... have... some major concerns about this whole setup right now. So if I put this here, right? And... I come up through here... and I don't get out in time... aren't I just screwed, basically? I guess I could pick it up, but if I'm not close enough to pick it up, then what? What if I leave the cube... right... right here? What then? Yeah, that's... that's a trapping situation. Alright. Huh. Not sure why you would design it that way, but okay. Well anyway... Probably want the reverse funnel for some reason, right? Something or other. Hmm. Let's just, uh, let's just get on out of here then, I suppose. Yeah, this seems like the best way to get out of here. We can drop out here, and then... Has that always been active? Never even noticed. I never even noticed, wow. Looks like we went the reverse tunnel for that. What else are the exit requirements, though? Both cubes. Oh, okay, that's trivial then. Hmm. Well, anyway, let's go do things as we normally do them. We're gonna go up here and make sure not to murder ourselves on the ceiling, that would be bad. Oh, and apparently this lost collision, because that's something laser cubes do sometimes. Alright, don't murder ourselves. That's good news. Ah, sure, that works. It's not what I meant to do, but it works too. What is the best way to do this? Because we're gonna want to keep the funnel, right? Hmm, well, I guess we'll just focus on that later. Focus on it later. So. Let's do this, and that just kills us. Gotcha. Alright. Let's, uh, control Z faster than hitting F F7 to load a quick save. There we go. So we're back to this point. We were here earlier. Pretend we just hit F7 to load a quick save, but the loading screens take way too long, so it's much easier to just no clip.
Well, we've got the laser cube back there, so... Let's just do that. And now we can come through here. Drop down here, like a normal person. And lift ourselves up as high as we possibly can. Yep, that seems to work out just fine for us. Oh, I didn't even notice in, there's an area t on top of the glass. Interesting. Right, well, let's see if this works in any capacity. Well, that certainly worked in some capacity. I get the feeling I should've brought the regular cube. I don't know about you guys, but I have a very strong feeling that I should've brought the regular cube. So, let's hit F7, and skip the load screen. And we had things... Ah, uh, crap, whatever. We were like this. Yeah, this is how we had things. So let's take the cube with us this time. I'm sure maybe actually hitting F7 might have been a bit faster, but whatever. Whatever, it works, it works. Right. Up and up we go, and uh, oh, I can't actually see. There we go. There we go, that works. Sure. Right. So we have that now, that's... Good news, I suppose. Yeah, so let's head back. And figure out what to do from here. I think we just need to put the laser cube on the funnel. And then pull ourselves over there. That should be pretty straightforward, right? Yep, seems pretty straightforward to me. You can even walk up on this to get us up to the height level high enough to jump into the funnel. So that should work out just fine. Let us do that. Walk all the way through here. And, uh, oh no, actually I need, first of all, I need to do this. There we go. Alright, portal there, portal here. Take the cube. Save. Continue. And, uh, yeah, let's do this. All the way across here. Walk up on this thing. All the way across here. Excellent. I think we're almost done now. I think we're pretty much done. Pull ourselves up here. We put one of the cubes down already. There we go. And then from here, things are pretty straightforward. Wow, the funnel dropped me onto the glass. <laughs> Strange. I have no idea what causes that. Anyway, come on, let's get through here. That was... that was, um... I don't know how to explain it, but... it was okay. I think it was an okay puzzle. I'll write it up. Yeah, right. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye! Nice work, Sadia Ra.